Yo, what's up guys? Me, Eddie again, and welcome back to another Funko Pop review. So we're back at it again. This time we'll be reviewing the new, well, it just came out a month ago. So today we'll be reviewing Grimlock from Transformers. So yeah, this is the original G1 Grimlock from Transformers, from the original G1 Generation 1 of Transformers. So yeah. So today, yes, this is actually another so this is another um funko pop um this is another um this is a part of the emerald city comic con exclusive yes this is an em emerald city comic con i'm sorry i'm just, I, I just talk so fast emerald city comic con exclusive so yeah it's also a gamestop exclusive so yeah so i found this in my local gamestop i wanted optimus prime but they didn't have any i mean gamestop they they always have they they always they always don't have good picks of funko like, they don't have the best, like, Funkos over there. They don't sell the best Pops. They always sell... They don't, like, they don't sell the best-selling ones. They always sell... Sometimes, but not really. So, yeah. So, in the back, we see the other... We got to see some of the Autobots and the Decepticons. We see Optimus Prime, Bumblebee, Megatron, and Jazz, and Soundwave. There was, a, there was another one over... There were some others, like like Starscream and... and, and uh, the, the, there's another one, which is a Funko Pop, which is a Funko website um exclusive it's a funko exclusive it's jet fire so yeah so i actually really love this box i'm not gonna lie like look at this like you can see the art the artwork it reminds me of the the good old g1 days like i'm not i'm not born in the 80s but like this is but this is this is always my like i'm always i'm always down for the g1 like i didn't yeah yeah we all know the movies yeah yeah i know so i'm always liking the g1 you know like i didn't I did. I mean, I watched the movies, but I know I'm always caring about the G1 looks of the Transformers. So yeah, though you know what's so unique about these things, about these 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 vinyls, these pops, these dolls, that these 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 actually they're supposed to resemble the their G1 original toy counterpart from 1984 to 1986. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Let me see Hasbro. And, uh, yeah, so I guess I'm going to open this real quick. Me, Grimlock, wanting to come get out of the box. <laughs> that, that's, seriously, that's how he, that's literally how he talks in the show. It's, I know, it's pretty, it's pretty cool and funny. Just seriously, Grimlock is, all, is pretty much one of my favorite, like, one of my favorite uh, box of all time. So we got Grimlock out of the box. It came out of the bow magazine. Grimlock wanna get out now! Alright, alright, come on, come on. Boom! Big Grimlock out of the box, haha! <laughs> okay, let's put these bad boys, okay, there we go. Oh shit. Look at this thing. Oh my god. This shit right here is badass. Like, I'm not gonna lie. This honestly looks like how it looks exactly like in the show. <laughs> Like, like I seen the movies and you know, in the movies he looks no like, like in the movie I seen the movie and <laughs> he looks nothing like like this like this is, he looks way different in the movie. I mean it's a movie. I mean it's Michael Bay. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. We all. I don't want. I, you know, let's not talk about that. <laughs> so again, he does not. He does not move his head. I mean, I mean, you know. I mean, I realized that the, the the one that bubbles their heads are mostly the Marvel and Star Wars ones. The ones that are licensed by Star Wars and, and Marvel, pretty much. So, yeah, this thing feels pretty heavy. Well, not heavy. I expect it to be big because, you know, he's a big guy in the show. I mean, he's a big bot robot in the show. This actually looks really, really cool. Like, look how shiny his head is. Like, like all, all, all that black and shit. You can see the red visor. That, that looks pretty cool. He's carrying his little red sword. It's supposed to resemble its toy counterpart, pretty much. Which is really cool. Nice gold finish. We got the red waist. <laughs> and your black. Okay, yeah. So, yeah. So, <laughs> can you imagine this thing turning into a T-Rex? I <laughs> Can you imagine that? But, yeah, it can <laughs> So yeah, the back, you know, there's so there's a lot to talk about the back. I mean, you, I can already tell this is the arms of the of his T-Rex form, and uh, this is supposed to be his. I can see a bit of his teeth, like if you can see closely. Yeah, I can see his little teeth. Yeah, you can see it. That's part of his dinosaur counterpart. That's pretty cool. 
I mean, yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, it's, I love the, like, there's so much, like, there's so much design, there's so much detail on this, on this toy, like, seriously, like, wow, <laughs> Jesus Christ, like, like, I, like, I swear to God, like, this is all I, this is the, probably the only thing I, one of the few things, I, like, this is by the only, the first time I ever bought, like, a Funko figure from GameStop, like, I never bought anything from GameStop, oh, no, I'm sorry, no, I do bought, I do buy shit from GameStop, usually games, but never a Funko, never a Funko Pop, no, never a Pop um, doll figure or whatever, but this is actually my first time getting one, and this is actually a GameStop exclusive, which... I'm pretty proud with because this thing is pretty much probably this thing could have been rare or could have go up for on eBay for pretty much a lot of money. So yeah, and it's also again it's also a it's a uh, Emerald City Comic Con exclusive. So yeah, same thing with the uh, the same thing with if you remember if you remember me doing the the Spider Man my twenty ninety nine Spider Man review. Yeah, that's also that's also um, Emerald City Comic Con, which I forgot to mention that in the other review. So yeah, so so basically, yeah. So I guess you know, there's not much, not much else I'd say. I mean, you know, he got he got his his big mean, he got his big arms. Well, not they're not big, but they look pretty. Big. Well, they're actually kind of big. <laughs> like they're about the size. They're about as big as his legs. Which that's the same thing with all Funkos. So yeah, <laughs> can you imagine? I mean, in so, like I know I seen I seen some parts of media like I think it was the comics or the show. I think I I think sometimes his visor's blue. Sometimes in the show, I pretty sure sometimes his visor's blue. Or I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, kind of hard plastic actually yeah so yeah so i guess that's it for the review um so that's that's uh that's um grimlock for you guys from transformers the funko pop funko pop grimlock from transformers i don't know i'm, I'm sorry to repeat that so many times sorry so yeah so i guess that's it for the review um so i guess i, I don't i got no more I, I don't have no more funkos for now so i i'll probably get some maybe next time i'll get more next time so maybe stay tuned for those so maybe yeah stay tuned for more funko pop reviews stay tuned for that comment down below which video you want me to do next so yeah so i guess that's it for the video and uh i'll see you guys next time peace out